uh, Jim Skinner, and uh, I celebrated my 90th birthday uh, with a parachute jump. The parachute jump was my daughter, Paula, and uh, it was quite remarkable because she was kind of a problem daughter to me for a long time, but when she come down, she threw me a kiss and says, happy birthday, Dad, and if it wasn't for you and AA, I wouldn't be doing this. So that was a remarkable uh, feat for her to get up there and do that, and I'm very thankful for that. Oh, I've been active in uh, running, and I was kind of joked to everybody, where'd you learn to run? I said, I had a machine gun after me on Iwo Jima. So I've been running all these years. I've done swimming pool work in, in St. Petersburg, and um, I'm enjoying the life up here in the villages now. I was a diving coach. I started out in Montgomery, Alabama with the YMCA and uh, when my daughters were pretty young. As my daughter Susan and Diane uh, grew a little bit older, uh, we had a diving team and um, what happened I built swimming pools and I had ended up with my knee uh, having a real problem so I couldn't work. I ended up up there in Destin, Florida uh, and um, the man over there had Country Duncan took me to Montgomery, Alabama and um, he offered me a job as a swimming pool instructor and with a big complex there and it was a frog pond. But I developed that, my daughter, I had a one meter, three meter diving board, and uh, Susan became Alabama diving champion. Um, and then she was invited to uh, Birmingham after we had a big meet. And it was a young girl that was about 10 years old. Her mother and father had this big, beautiful home there, and they had, uh, uh, a diving board on the thing, so I went in on weekends and was helping Susan and uh, Jenny Chandler. And if you're not familiar with Jenny Chandler, she won a gold medal in the Olympics in Toronto. So I was her first coach. And, uh, Fred told uh, the fellows, don't try to run with him and hit the kids around the track. Team with John Trapp was our coach. And uh, I looked at Fred and I said, you know, I won three gold medals in Winter Haven last week, and then I come over the track on Monday and a little five-year-old kid beat me. 